since this is a very special retreat focused on the practice of jhana aiming at gaining deep concentration that can be used for practicing vipassana meditation even better the preliminaries of both jhana meditation and vipassana meditation are the same we want to start this retreat with the practice of metta <coughs> loving friendliness we want to start this practice of loving friendliness with ourselves therefore <coughs> i am going to recite metta sentences metta formula you just listen and very sincerely honestly try to cultivate these thoughts these feelings of metta towards you and others as i recite the formula the honest honesty sincerity in the practice of metta is absolutely necessary as a basis of this practice therefore relax your posture relax the body relax the mind and with deep faith confidence in this practice let us begin as i said i recite very slowly with pauses for all of us to contemplate on these thoughts and you just focus your mind on these thoughts with utmost sincerity with honest feeling honest attitude towards you and towards others the formula <coughs> is uh, repetitive and simple all our resident meditators and those who have been attending our retreats know them by heart others who are not attending our retreats who are not residents probably may not remember all of them sometimes when we recite this this formula together we may not focus on the meaning of these words but almost mechanically we recite i like to urge you all to listen to these words not just mechanically but with deep meaning of each word <coughs> may we be well happy 
and peaceful. May no harm come to us. May no difficulties come to us. May no problems come to us. May we always meet with spiritual success. May we also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May our parents be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May our teachers be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May our relatives be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. 
may no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May our friends be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all indifferent persons be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all unfriendly persons be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. 
may no problems come to them. May they always meet with success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all living beings be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all females, all males, all humans, all non-humans, all divine beings, all noble ones, all non-noble ones, all animals and all beings in the northern direction be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all those who are in the northeastern direction be well happy 
and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all those who are in the eastern direction be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all beings in south eastern direction be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties problems and failures in life. May all those who are in the southern direction be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life.
may all beings in south western south western direction be well happy and peaceful may no harm come to them may no difficulties come to them may no problems come to them may they always meet with spiritual success may they also have patience courage understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties problems and failures in life May all beings in the western direction be well, happy and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems and failures in life. May all those who are in the north western direction be well happy and peaceful may no harm come to them may no difficulties come to them may no problems come to them may they always meet the spiritual success may they also have patience courage understanding and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties problems and failures in life May all beings above one above us in space be well happy and peaceful May no harm come to them May no difficulties come to them May no problems come to them May they always meet with spiritual success.
May they also have patience, courage, understanding, and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems, and failures in life. May all those who are below us in space be well, happy, and peaceful. May no harm come to them. May no difficulties come to them. May no problems come to them. May they always meet with spiritual success. May they also have patience, courage, understanding, and determination to meet and overcome inevitable difficulties, problems, and failures in life. These are friendly thoughts that protect us from all resentment, anger, disappointment, these are the thoughts that we have to cultivate before we start concentration. These are the thoughts that heal our wound of disappointment, resentment. With these thoughts, we relax the body, relax the mind. And these thoughts envelop us. Charge our body and mind with these thoughts. And then take deep breaths three times. Just to become aware of the touch of breath at the tips of our noses or the rims of our nostrils. or inside the nose between eyes. Then we must pay attention exclusively on the breathing without taking any detail into account. we stay on this sensation of breathing. We notice the long breath, short breath, inhale, exhale, until the grossness of the breath disappears. Don't try to force yourself anything. 
don't try to anticipate anything don't try to make anything forcefully happen to you just pay attention to this breath As the grossness of the breath slowly smoothen out, because of the relaxed, friendly mental attitude, you experience a degree of calmness and would not let any thought disturb your mind whatever arises we let go of that no clinging no craving for anything whatever craving arises we let it go we don't encourage it nourish it we simply let it pass this is the thought of renunciation renouncing the thoughts of pleasure, thought of greed, thought of attachment, we let go of them. That is our thought of renunciation. Don't be cruel to yourself hard on you don't be critical Criti don't criticize yourself just have a very relaxed attitude of let come what comes that is a compassionate thought We must cultivate these thoughts of renunciation, thought of friendliness, thought of compassion. No criticizing, no analyzing. Just have this attitude It's very easy when the breath becomes relaxed, subtle, for the mind to stay on it. It is easy at the same time for us to be very friendly towards ourselves and have the same friendly feelings towards everybody else. easy for us to let go of our greed and easy to be very compassionate towards us and others this is just an attitude as the breath becomes relaxed all this happen
then the grossness of breath slowly fades away. At first you might be able to notice the breath more distinctly and clearly as you keep focusing mind on the breath with this friendly attitude, compassionate attitude, attitude of renunciation, the breath becomes even more subtle and you feel more refined. You may come to a stage where you may feel that the breath does not exist anymore. Because of your thought of renunciation, friendliness and compassion, you won't be frightened when the breath becomes unnoticeably subtle. That becomes your second, more internal, mental object. That time it is no longer an external feeling of breath, but more subtle inner memory of the breath. And as you stay on it, you gain confidence in your sincere, honest practice. When you have this confidence, the mind becomes more relaxed and filled with rapture or joy, which grows slowly, a degree by degree, filling the entire mind and body with this feeling of joy or the feeling of rapture. That naturally blossoms in happiness Again, the body and mind becomes charged with this feeling of happiness. That feeling of happiness fills the mind and opens the luminous mind Our mind is naturally luminous. That luminosity appears in a spark of light. If it is very bright light covering large area, just try to transcend that, pass that until you feel a spark of light, very sharp, one-pointed. That is the first level of 
absorption concentration known as jhana. Don't try to force all this. The secret is to relax the body, relax the mind, and let this happen naturally. When the mind is ready, they all happen naturally. We cannot force them prematurely to happen. All we have to do is to prepare the mind for these things to grow, develop, ending in gaining this concentration. You may sit as long as you can. Only when sitting becomes very difficult, producing extreme pain, that you may slowly, quietly, without making any noise, stand up and stay standing as long as you can. When that becomes uncomfortable, you may start walking very slowly, quietly and mindfully. Being fully aware of your quietness, of your movement and the breath, do walking meditation as long as you like, and then return to the cushion. Please don't rush. Spiritual growth is very slow and steady and very sure to attain if we do not rush. Now I stop talking, so you can continue this process for the rest of this morning.